the growth of the older population is a major demographic challenge for our society. And I, I view it as an opportunity, not as a problem. So currently older adults are about 13% of the total population. By 2030, you'll be about 20%. And there's a tremendous need for professionals and paraprofessionals who have gerontological expertise to work with this growing population. A lot of people avoid thinking about aging. They don't want to think about aging. They associate aging with death and dying. And so we have that barrier to overcome. But I always say once you recruit someone to older, work with older adults, they get really hooked. We've had people who've shifted from banking or real estate or legal assistance. Some people make pretty major changes. The majority are individuals who they have a bachelor's degree, they've been working either in the field with older adults but never had any training, or they're making a career change. We've had people who are personal trainers but they are working so much with older adults in their jobs who want to take the courses so they understand the age-related changes. Uh, we have people that may have been in uh, the travel industry and they are seeing a lot of older people who are traveling. So you don't have to be someone who's only going to specialize in gerontology to benefit. We sort of cover the three major aspects of aging, the biological, the social, cultural, and the psychological. The obvious advantage of the online is that anybody can take it at any time. One of the most common ways they connect is through a discussion board. They'll pose particular questions and students are expected to pose X number of responses, but many times the students go way beyond that minimal expectation. And so they, they get to know the instructor and each other that way. But I want to really emphasize what an exciting field gerontology is. And it's exciting because it is changing so rapidly these days. I mean, you pick up the New York Times and every day there seems to be a new article about research or practice innovation or, you know, it's just it's very, very dynamic. And it's very rewarding to work with older adults. You learn so much, you benefit from their wisdom. And once people commit to the field, they love it.